Hey Vinyl Community, today I'm going to be doing another video on an artist that I think you should listen to. Now these are artists that I am hoping you will get as excited about as I am. Some of these artists have been around a while. The last one I did was Elliot Smith, but today I am going to be doing Ray LaMontagne. He's one of the greatest singer-songwriters, I feel, of the last decade or two. He's really been around, I think his first album came out in the early 2000s, but he is so fantastic. He skips around genres. If you like Bob Dylan, if you like the Beatles, if you like Pink Floyd, if you like Van Morrison, you will find something to love in Ray LaMontagne. He covers every spectrum of music there is, sometimes on the same album, but he is just phenomenal. I cannot say enough great things about Ray LaMontagne. So hopefully you've got a little bit of time here. I'm gonna play some songs samples from my favorite Ray LaMontagne songs. The first one I'm going to play is from his very first album, his debut. It's called Trouble, and the track is called Shelter. Kind of a folky type track, but he's got a lot of... His voice has so much uh, emotion in it. I love the timbre of his voice, and I love his songwriting. It's just so fabulous. And so this is pretty representative of the rest of this album, but I'll have you give a listen and you can make up your own mind. track I'm going to play is off my personal favorite La Montaigne album. It's the second album. It's called Till the Sun Turns Black. And this is a track called Three More Days. And this will show you the stylistic shifts that Ray La Montaigne is able to do and do them brilliantly and so successfully. This has got a very much a soul Motown Stax feel to it. Just so convincing and so uh, gorgeous the way that he pulls this song off. <laughs> Oh, you know I will be coming home to you. 
And now on this very same album, like I said, this is my favorite La Montaigne album. This is a track called Gone Away From Me. And this sounds very much like Van Morrison. Uh, and that's what I love. He goes from soul to, you know, Celtic rock or whatever you want to call it. It's just really a, uh, a fantastic shift. And he covers so much territory on this album. Stylistically, it's really uh, kind of breathtaking. <laughs> track I want to play it's off an album called Supernova I actually saw him on this tour uh, for this album and this time he goes full on Pink Floyd early Pink Floyd Sid Barrett era at Psychedelia late 60s you got some Beatles harmonies on here you've got definitely uh, that whole psychedelic 1967 68 vibe and it's just gorgeous I have no idea how he pulls these tracks off so convincingly but Again, he jumps around from genre to genre, and he's just not satisfied staying put. He does one genre so successfully, and then he moves on to the next one. And you can tell all his influences uh, in these tracks. <laughs> Uh, just a little sampling of Ray LaMontagne. I hope you do check him out. And as always, thanks for watching.